We welcome you to a special edition focusing on measures put in place by the Nigerian Correctional Service to ameliorate the high cost of transportation arising from the removal of wealth subsidy. The Controller General of Corrections, Aliru Nababa, on assumption of office in 2021, had assured the staff welfare will remain the priority of the service. His performance, no doubt, has demonstrated this commitment with the construction of new barracks, payment of staff entitlements, and many more. To further buttress this commitment, the Controller General recently announced pilotives on transportation for staff members to ease their movement to and from office by readjusting operations of the official staff bosses. We all rely on our monthly salaries. So because of that, the Controller General out of his magnanimity decided to bring so many interventions so as to alleviate the sufferings of the staff, to increase the number of vehicles. About six routes were later created, which include Guagualada, Kuji, Yenya, Masaka, Karo, and Guarimba. The service assured that the palliative is aimed at bringing succor to its personnel with a view to enhancing service delivery in line with mandates. This major by the service as a palliative now means the burden on your salary in the area of spending on transportation is virtually reduced the staff. By extension we can say the morale of the staff is now high. They are sure of coming and going back to their homes as at when due. I'm impressed by our current CGC, Halir Nababa. What he did is marvelous in the history of the service. The president is talking about renewal. Our CG is one of the, the officers that are working throughout that renewal and is adding circle and, and life to our staff. And I speak to you, the staff are so impressed. And I believe we sincere God that God be with him. More massive things will come to development in this Nigeria Correctional Service. You, that's why the transport system, I want to mention also that we have never won Weakness the massive promotion. Massive promotion, both junior and senior, receive in this administration. The beneficiaries who spoke to a crew commended the controller general for the kind gesture. We've been looking for this kind of opportunity to thank the CGC, Hali Runababa, FICMC, MFR, MNI for his kind fatherly humanitarian gesture towards the staff of Nigerian Correctional Service. Before the, this palliative came, we knew what we saw on the road. Coming to work was a tax. It was like a nightmare. But after this, the introduction of the palliative, you can see the smile on my face. You can see that all the staff are happy. Coming to work became like a thing of joy. We are happy the environment has automatically changed. I'm grateful to him and I wish that this will continue. If new vehicles can be given to us, it will sustain what he has started. Because it will make no sense that you are giving fuel and uh, you get to the way vehicle breaks and can't take you to your destination. Now, if we can get newer vehicles, it will go a long way to sustain this good work he has started. Ah, it's a good palliative. The CGC have tried for us. Because transportation now, from Kujie to this place, if you don't have 2,000 naira, you cannot even come. That's a good palliative. Join us again next week for another interesting package. Thank you for your time. Until then, it's bye for now.